Good day, guys. God bless you. Good afternoon, good evening, whatever time it is. Unknown Prophet Fred Watkins coming on. And I'm not bringing you a word from God today. I'm bringing you a word from Fred. I stand here before you, having given two words that have not come to pass. I know there are those who are out there screaming for me to admit that I lied, admit that I made it all up. I can't do that. I know it would make you happy. And it would answer a lot of questions. But I am not going to say that I lied about something that I fully believe I heard. At the same time, I know the Father does not lie. He is not man that he should lie. And so to give you an answer on why neither one of these prophecies, both related basically to the same thing, why they did not take place, I don't have an answer. But at the same time, I will not try to squirm my way out of the fact that I said it and that I fully believe still, even now, that what I gave you was what the Lord gave me. I have been back to him, <laughs> believe me, a number of times in the last day, just inquiring, Father, did I mess up? I believe I hear my father. I have been listening to his voice for 30 some years. And I'm hearing that same voice. I know that I can also be impacted by the demonic, which is why inevitably I will not go into conversation with my father without first silencing any demonic in the vicinity sealing their mouths shut, and I know that works because I have done it many times in deliverance. And so I know the truth of it. And I command any that are there in the name of Jesus and by his blood to be gone. So I remove any demonic that would interfere. There are times when I have slipped up and forgotten to do that. Inevitably, I hear the Father seemingly saying something that just doesn't fit, and I realize that I messed up and forgot to do it. I'm sorry, the light just went off on the computer, but it'll be back on in a minute. Maybe you don't need to see me that well anyway. There we go. <laughs> You don't know how this makes me feel because I know that there are thousands of you out there who do listen to me, not because of me, but because of the Father's word that comes through me. And I know that it has confused some of you and I, I hate that. And I apologize for that, the fact that it has confused you but I do not apologize for what I spoke. Beyond that, I don't know what to say. I do know that the word that I speak from the Father generally fits 1 Corinthians 14, verse 3. That's 1 Corinthians 14, verse 3. It says, anyone who prophesies speaks to men for their strengthening, encouragement, and comfort. And I do believe that most all of the words that the Father gives me fit that pattern. If you recall, when I posted the two that have failed, I told you that I argued with Father. 
<laughs> and I didn't want to post them because I, I detest posting something with times and dates on it. And yet, that's what he told me to do. And so I did it. I don't apologize for doing it, but I apologize that it has confused some of you. And if you decide that this makes me a false prophet and decide to drop your joining of this channel, I will fully understand it. If you want to unsubscribe, I will fully understand it. And again, I'm sorry if it has caused you that grief. I think, I think, and, and this is not a cop out. This is not something to try to reassure you that I know what I'm doing. I leave that up to you. And that's the reason <laughs> I found it interesting that the Lord had me post what he had me post on Wednesday <laughs> to be sure that you check and that you assess every word that comes to you to determine whether you believe it's from the Father or not. I knew I was sitting there looking at a possible total failure of a second prophecy that I have given, and yet the Father was giving me that to post. Ironic. No, I take that back. He knows what he's doing. He had a reason for doing that. And so now I say to you, you guys, I love every one of God's children. You're all brothers and sisters to me. And if you, like I said, decide to unsubscribe, I will fully understand. If you decide to stay with me, all I can say is God bless you and I love you. That is the word of Fred Watkins, the unknown prophet, for today, bringing it to you on the 2nd of November, 2024. God bless you.